not COVID. But it is Khalil Mack. He's a linebacker for the Bears. The Bears. And he's um, the 19th best player on the top 100 players of 2020. Is it going to happen again? No, it's not. I'm feeling absolutely on fire right now. I do want to welcome you back. I want to welcome you back to the series. We are in the teens. His name's Khalil Mack. For some weird reason, I always get Khalil Mack and Von Miller mixed up. They're the two players in the top 20 every single year that just don't do it for me for some reason. You know what I mean? I think, you know, they're defensive players. Look, they're absolute hustlers on the field. We know what they do. They tackle, they make sacks, they make plays, they play with aggression, they play with violence. They're effective on the field, but at the end of the day, there's one factor that separates them from my favorite players, and that is the fact that they play on the defensive side of the ball. It's just never ever gonna be as exciting as, uh, as the offensive side of the ball. That is my opinion. It hasn't changed. It may change, but not yet. Anyways, guys, let's see if it can change throughout this video. It's Khalil Mack, it's two minutes and 58 seconds long. Let's go. Mack, you guys had to play against. Master. Khalil Mack. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What about Khalil Mack? <laughs> I don't know if I'm remembering this guy correctly. Khalil Mack, man, he's just, he's a force. Oh my gosh. I mean, the dude is just a bully. <laughs> he gets the running back down and then gives Howard, just gives him some loving. I'm sure he said, great run. His speed to power, his long arm. Uh, he has the best long arm in the game. Put that head on the inside sort of a tackle. What I'm doing, guys, is I'm seeing if my opinion on this guy can be swayed throughout this three minute video without saying anything. And I'll tell you what, it's happening already. And down he goes! It's Khalil Mack on the set! Just his presence in general is something that everybody has to game plan for. Everybody talks about him being this premier pass rusher as he is, but he does more than just that. He's an effort guy as well. He's out there grinding. What a trap! First time we played him, I was leading up to go and help the tight end block him. This is the first time I've seen CJ Ham actually play. He's given a lot of input, but it's the first play I've actually seen him. And he's number 30, and he just did a block for his old mate Delvin Cook. But it's going to get blown up by Khalil Mack. Let's watch that again. It's out there grinding. What a trap! I was leading up to go and help the tight end block him. I gave him everything I had. He ate it. He said, ooh, I like that. And I said, all right, yeah. I see what's going on. I see how this game going to be. Khalil Mack iron down. Fuck yeah, that's exciting, man. But I want to see that hit again. Look at this. Up to go and help. Look at this, he gets past 82 and then he fucking just gives it to him. Help the tight end block him. I gave him everything I had. He did, he did. He lowered his shoulder, he gave him everything he had. It's not like CJ Ham got flattened, but I tell you what, Khalil Mack didn't move very far. He ate it. He said, ooh, he ate like it. That. He did. <laughs> and I said, alright, yeah. I see what's going on. I see how this game going to be. Khalil Mack, Aaron Donald, they require a lot of attention. It was like a couple weeks when I was getting attention like they was getting. Yeah, I'm like, oh, I can't see how they go through this every game. We tried to find ways to wear them out, get him tired, get him to get off the field. And every time he got off the field, we tried to go hurry up because every time he's on the field, he's messing plays with He is a fucking beast. I'm winning. He reminds me of uh, Zion Williamson. My rushes. You literally getting there a second before me. Look at his arms, bro. Oh my god. Why have I forgotten how big this guy is? It's because he's on the defensive side of the ball. Khalil Mack. Six foot three, 120 kilograms. Six time pro bowler. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. 
three-time first first team all pro 15 16 and 18 defensive player of the year in 2016 he made the nfl 2010's all decade team and he made the 100 greatest bears of all time 465 for the 40 yard dash a 40 inch vertical jump that's out of this world appreciation for what type of athlete he really was. There was a play this year versus the Vikings, and he was able to push through the tackle, bump the guard, and make it there for the sack. Beating a true double team in aggressive fashion is one of the more impressive things I've ever seen from a defensive rusher. It's not fair, Jeff. He's too good. What's really unfair is a rookie tight end having to mm -hmm. block Khalil Mack by himself. We audibled out of a play, and I got caught in protection one-on-one -on -one against him. Before the play, I'm like, holy, I'm about to go one-on-one -on -one and pass protection against Khalil Mack. Well, this is your time to shine, bruv. It didn't go very well. Oh. So we didn't get much time to sort of get... Play, I'm like, holy, I'm about to go... <laughs> holy. Yeah, you're about to go one-on-one. -on -one. But I'll tell you what, there is one, two, three, four, five, six Broncos against one, two, three, four Bears. One on one and pass protection against Khalil Mack. They've got a two on one on this guy, they've got a two on one on this guy. But it's a play action. <laughs> Go very well. See, he should have given it to the and running back. <laughs> if he had given it to the running back, he would have had a lane up the middle and he would have given this guy a nice wee shake and been gone, I'm telling you. Mac is very immense. He puts on a lot of pressure, and I'll tell you what, I think he's swayed my mind. I reckon I've, I've definitely got some respect for Khalil Mack. I wouldn't want to play against him. But he's not the most memorable guy. I just don't I just don't know why. But in the next one, we're looking at a guy who is memorable to me. His name's Travis Kelsey. He plays tight end for the Chiefs. And he's got a brother in the league too. By the name of Zach. Who plays for the Eagles, I think. So, you know what guys? There was one one question really at the start of that video, and one question only, and that was whether I was gonna be swayed of my opinion on Khalil Mack after that video, and I feel like I was. I really do. I mean, he made the NFL All-Decade team. He is going to be an absolute problem against any team. He's going to be faster and more powerful than most that he's going against, which doesn't make an easy proposition for the quarterback. The quarterback always has to have an eye on Khalil Mack and where he's coming from, right? And if you're not double-teaming Khalil Mack, you ain't going to stop him. Anyways, guys, the next video we're looking at Travis Kelsey. He's a tight end. He plays for the Chiefs. I'm going to chuck my Chiefs jersey on, and I'll see you back here shortly. Thanks for watching, guys. You're absolute legends. I love you, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.